Welcome back, sports fans, to the latest match of the Brew Bowl, a Blood Bowl 7 tournament proudly sponsored by Bugman 7X. I'm your host, Wilhelm Wolfsbane. Tonight we have what I hope will be one of the most brutal games of the round as we see two teams who, by and large, like getting around in little to no armour, going head-to-head -head in a match to see who's still staying when the final whistle blows. Our home team tonight are the slow ticket Pantraders. After losing the first two matches of the season, the Halflings came back to win last week against the Scrayvold Butchers, in a match which surprisingly saw the Corn team take the most casualties, or injuries. There were deaths on both sides, but the Raiders have bounced back to bring a full team tonight. They're hoping to achieve what few Halfling teams can only dream of, a two-game winning streak. Here to crush the hopes and dreams of the Raiders, uh, uh, we welcome back the Lightberg Knights. Technically, both undefeated and unvictorious, the Knights are the only team in the competition to still record only draws this season. Last week it was against the Fungus Bay Fanatics, where the team captain Karina Von Kreese so Karina Von Rees gave the Knights an early touchdown, but the Goblins were able to rally in the dying minutes and equalise the score. The biggest impact of that match, however, would be the injury of star runner Lana Metzger. Her absence will be felt heavily by the Knights tonight. Before we get to the game, it's time to have a chat with one of our team managers, and tonight that manager happens to be Lord Hunger, manager of the Leichberg Knights, and what appears to be a brain in a jar. Uh, Lord Hunger, welcome back to the Cabal Vision Studio. You're welcome. Uh, it's a pleasure to be here. And I understand you don't recognise him. He's lost a little bit of weight. This is TJ Watson, former player, now assistant coach. We're uh, trying him out on a trial run today to see how he goes. Former player of both the Hammerers and the Wraiths, I believe. Yes, yes. Excellent player there. Um, he doesn't have much to say at the moment, but I'm, I'm sure he'll be full of advice for me once we get down on the pitch. Very well. Well, welcome to you then, Mr. Watson. Uh, now, let's get started by talking about the last thing I mentioned during the intro. Both, uh, so, so tonight the Knights are taking the field without their runner. Metzger is your highest scorer this season, with half the team's touchdowns so far attributed to her. What's your plan for replacing Lana's uh, speed and skill tonight? Uh, we'll be going back to the tried and true. We'll be using uh, Sonia Von Hoff tonight. Um, I mean, last season she proved that she's definitely capable of scoring. So we'll just be a little bit slower. So we'll just have to replace that speed with brutality. Now, I'm sure that three draws isn't where you wanted to see yourself after three matches in the season. Though I will note that draws have been coming thick and heavy this season for every team. You're sitting on only three competition points, which is actually the same as your opponents tonight, who have only recorded a single win. I'm sure the Knights would love another shot at the playoffs. With the competition round only halfway through, how do you rate your chances and what needs to change for the Knights? Um... Well, last season we had a lot of trouble with people picking up the ball and we instituted a strict regime of beating people who failed to handle the ball correctly. So we've decided to take that same tactic with people who seem to fail to go for it and sprint just that little bit faster. So hopefully they're going to be a little bit more sure-footed or the beatings will continue. <laughs> Lord Hunger, we have seen that your vampires are highly skilled at taking down weakly armoured players, especially their own teammates. The Halflings have lighter armor than your thralls are you going to be looking to take as many stunties out as possible during the match or is board movement more important to you normally ball movement is more important however that hasn't exactly played out well in the last three games so we're going to try and mix it up a little bit and we're going to go for equal mix brutality and ball handling what about those two treatment poplar wood talent and kindred long branch they do form a formidable part of the part of the raiders defensive line and either player is more than a match strength wise for your own varg heist any plans on how you're going to fell those trees? Uh, we're going to try and avoid the trees. Uh, if we have to take them down, we're just going to swarm them with as many people as possible. I think I think that's going to be the only way we can do this. All right. Let me touch on a question I asked other managers this week. There are rumours abounding that the league officials are considering whether giant round or lineman round is going to be a bigger draw for the fans. I've been to know where you stand, Lord Hunger. Do you like the biggest of big guys, or is running around with the most stock team you can find your your jam? Well, after my successful defeat of the gladiators in the giant round last time, without a gladi without a giant on my part, I think I can clearly say that giants aren't all that. Um, I think that the lineman round would certainly be interesting. I'd certainly enjoy seeing what other people can do in that situation without their uh, usual panoply of uh, star players and and expert positionals. Um, might be a challenge for me as well because thralls aren't exactly great but it would be interesting I, I would rather see the lineman round i think i'd like to see something different interesting all right lord hunger any final pearls of wisdom that you would like to add 
Uh, not right now. No, no. Well, I'll save any pearls of wisdom for, for the end of our match. There you have it. World Sports fans, the time has come for the players to take the field. The halflings look desperate for supper, and the vampires look desperate to dine. On halflings. Tonight will be a no-holds-barred match, except for the ones that are barred, but only if you get caught. Let's get down there and watch these two brutal, dirty, nasty teams try to pick each other apart. It's time for Blood Bowl. All right. So let's do the all-important rolling to start off with. Uh, so uh, I will go first with the halflings as the home team. Do they want to make a corporate roll? The answer is definitely not. Did you want to make a corporate roll to try and improve your winnings or getting a sponsor? Uh, no. no. Zero, okay. so I will not attempt. All right. Um, the halflings are going to use promotion for fan factor. So they're a plus one. Uh, oh, there you go. They will get three fan factor. Would you like to use promotion or would you rather use the D3? I will use promotion since it's a plus one as well. Okay. Ten, so it would Ten. be three and three. Nice uh, high paying match. Uh, and finally, the Raiders will roll for training to try and get a pro, a plus one. Uh, that is a pro. Um, so I will give a pro to the other treeman who's not got pro naturally. All right, and you may choose to roll training if you like. Yes, it's a plus three. Oh, yeah. okay. Who would like to give pro to? Um, we're going to give it to ooh, Gustav. Uh, Gustav is, yeah, uh, ball stripper. Is, the ball stripper is now also a pro. Okay, you can yeah. refresh him. All right, let's get the game started in pool play. Yeah, we also have to roll for the extra yeah, desperate yeah, measures. measures. That's true. So let's, we'll just get through the first stuff. Bring on opponent. Sorry, just have to open that page. Okay, so okay. we can both put in three fan factor. Okay, you can put in uh, a desperate measure and an assistant coach. So as the home team first, I'll roll to see if I get a free desperate measure from help comes at last on a three plus. I do not. You can roll to see if you get a free different measure on a three plus. Come on. Once. No. Uh, but you do get the one you, you get the one you paid for on a D eight. Okay. Something good. Five is set piece. Oh, that's good. That's a good yep. one. One of my favourites. Okay. Alright, just, just don't forget you've got it. Yes. Alright. Let, let me just drop that down on a piece of paper. Okay. Stick it to your forehead. All right, I'm going to roll a d6 for my half of the weather. It is the spring table today. Uh, I got a three, so you can roll a dice, but no matter what you roll, it's going to be nice weather. There we go. Uh, would you like heads or tails? Um, I will take tails. Tails. It is heads. Um, I am going to receive in the first half, please. Okay. So I'll remove some players, and you can begin setting up to kick off. Okay. So that, there right. we go. Yep. Mm. Have to watch out for your throwing teammate shenanigans. <laughs> um. Alright. I'm good. Where did I get the ball to? Where is the ball? There it is. I'm going to go for a nice middle ground. All right. Roll your deviate roll. 
one to seven is one straight back and then 2d6 for the kick up event 10 blitz. is a blitz finally yep. i get a blitz c3 plus one players three players get the blitz Okay. Hmm. Do I go on the offense or do I just sort of pull back and make some mess? You know what? Let's go a little bit offensive. And we're going to blitz with Adelhard yep. against Hamfast. Yep, three plus. Oh. Or two plus because he's blitzing. He's bloodlust first. Yep, he's good. One, two, three, four, five, six. Two plus, go, go for, for it. it. Good. Uh, it'd be three dice, I believe. Uh, five, yes, five, versus, dice. five versus two, yep. Got him. He's not. Oh, he's got dodge. Sorry, so it'll be a push. Push him here. Yep, and then three dice again. Uh, go for it first. Sorry. Yep, and then three dice again. Another push. All right, and then the ball bounces. D eight. Three. That bounces one forward. All right, um, I will start my turn one. Um, all right, I think we're going to start with a blitz by Poplar Wood Talon into Adelhard. So take root. Uh, he's got pro. I'll try pro. Yes, okay, take root. Okay. One and then two for the blitz. So it'll be two dice, I believe, because it's strength six versus strength five. Two dice. Um, uh, do I want to use my team rebel already? I think I better. <laughs> uh, great start. Freeman don't have. Um, uh, no, um, they don't have. Uh, Lona. Lona, no. Okay. okay, it's just a push. Um, oh, I should have realized he's got. Um, they have Juggernaut? They don't have Juggernaut, no. Um, all right. Uh, next step is I will move one, two guys forward. I'm going to have Deagle go one, two. I'll pick the ball up. Uh, no, he's, a, he's got... That's it. He drops the ball. Goes to five. And over to you. Your turn one. Hmm. Okay. Been a good start so far. Yeah, that's not the usual terrible start. <laughs> Makes a nice change. Can I really get down and do anything about it? And he's going to block Sega. Yep. Two dice. Got him. Let's put him down here. Pulling up? No. Okay, I'm wrong. That's through. Injury? Come on. Same for the injury. Ah, oh, it's pretty much just as good. It's an 11. Um. I will just sort of record the casualty for Ibsen. I'm going to use the Apothecary in this one because he is a, he's a good player with Dauntless. So try okay. the Apothecary. Yes, so he just goes to reserve. That's a good start to the game. Yeah.
Otto is going to throw a block against Tam fast. Yep. Two dice. Yep. Yeah. Yep. You haven't got any guard or any weird things going no. on there? Push. Uh, why don't you? I, I will fend as well. Oh, you've got fend? Yep. Okay. He's a hefty. Gonna try his bloodlust. Yep. He's just moving. It's two plus. He's good. And Sonia is going to blitz. Yep. Gonna blitz ham fast. Okay. So two plus. Six, gonna go for it. You're good. Yep. Two dice. Push. I will. Oh, yeah, I will. I pro. I pro. Yep. Yep. Real one dice. Still push. Um. Back. I'll fend. You fending? Yep. Okay. And. That's it. End of my turn. Cool. All right. Um, all right. I'm going to start by having Poplar hit Otto. So um, take root first. It's fine. So you'll be five. Six versus four, so it's gonna be two, just two dice. Got him. I will not follow up. Uh, no, with mighty blow. Um, okay. I am dodging out ham fast on a three plus. Yep. One, two, three. Pick up on a three plus. Ah. The L. Okay. Here it goes again. Five, six, sorry, six goes. So Dive it behind him. All right. I think the halflings need to institute the beatings for failed <laughs> handlings as well. Back to you. Okay. Okay, let's see what we can do here. Hmm. Otto is going to stand up. Step in here. So Henrik is going to oh, Gustav is going to punch Otto. Yep. Henrik is going to move. Sonia is going to move, so it's going to be a. Th 
three. She's going to blitz. Okay. This would be a two plus. Six. It's going to hit Hanfist. So do I roll? You roll. Pick pick, up first? You, you the ball. You, you got to pick up the ball first before you enter the as we enter the square. Okay, so she's got the ball. Then go for it. I believe she's a six movement. Yeah. Yeah. Go, yep. go for it to hit. I'm going to use my re-roll rather re -roll. than pro. It's over here. Good. There we go. One into a one. Come on. Ah. Uh, okay. The curse is broken. Two dice. Oh, you've got oh, block. Okay. Yeah. Roll armor. On the spell. Seven is not enough. It's eight. Oh, they're eight. Yep, they're hefty. I'm going to go for it once. Yep. This is a mistake, but. Uh, you can pro it still. I'm going to try pro. No. No. There she goes. All right, armor roll first. Oh, sorry. Oh, well, sorry. The ball, the ball went a six, so put it there. Um, only, it only matters because the ball bounces back into a square whether she's there or not, basically. Yeah. Uh, that's not through armor. That's turn over. All right. Sorry. That's right. Why are you apologizing to me? Um, all right. No, I just no, I just clicked in turn as you clicked. Oh, okay. No worries. So, so it, it's showing your turn four when okay. it should show your turn three. Yeah. Okay, fixed it. Cool. All right. Uh, I'm going to declare a blitz with kind root into Henrik. So take root. That is fine. One, two. All right, I'm going to two to there, and it'll be a go for it to blitz. Good. Two dice. Got him. Uh, and armor. Uh, not even with mighty blow. Uh, I will go for it to here as well. Come on, fall over, fall over. Okay, no, my guys who fall over on go for it. All right, we're gonna stand up hand fast for three, four, five, go for it. <laughs> and he falls over now as well. Okay. All right. Armor roll. Uh, that's not through armor. That was almost. And the ball goes to six. This keeps me further back towards my line. All right. Over to you. Okay. Henrik is going to stand up. Yep. Or... Five, six, get to there. Sonia is going to move. Yep. So, so three plus, which is good. Three, four, dodge. Yep. Two plus. Good. Five, six, go, go for, for it. it. Pick up. And one more go for it to get in. Four. There we go. Yeah. <laughs> I had to do it eventually through just sheer will. Yeah, that was ridiculous. <laughs> uh, okay, so gonna put one on the night. There we go. Okay. And reset all players. Hopefully this works. I had to bring some extra players in for your team that might go to the wrong side. Let's find out. Yeah, they did. I've never I, seen it do that. Ah, uh, it's because I because I bought them in from like the um not through the it doesn't matter it's it's it's, it's a vagarity of how this works how this setup works. Okay. Um. All right. So you're kicking to me. Yes, I am. <sighs> oh, did you record the touchdown on tour play? Yep. Okay. Yep. Touchdown is recorded. The hell am I doing?
Okay, there we go. Um, right, I'm good. So I need to apologize. I've got a cat that's very interested in my microphone right now. So if you hear gnawing noises, it's not me. Sure, we believe you. <laughs> Kick to the same spot. All right, deviate roll. See if we can get the same again. Uh, so it's similar, one to five. And then kick off event. Same again. No, it's a brilliant coaching. So uh -huh, let's see if the brain I, in the jar helps. I have two coaches. So I get a total of seven. You have one coach. You know, I get the brain did not help. Just right. sits on the sideline and just goes bloop. And then the ball bounces. Or onto the treeman. We will catch it on a six. No. Bounces again to five beside the treatment. There we go. And I can start my turn four. All right. Um, let me try and get the ball first. So one, two, three. Three plus. Okay. Finally, a halfling has touched the ball. Three, uh, four, five. Okay. Actually, no, we're going to put it back there. Back. Okay, we're going to attempt to move Kyra at Long Branch. He moves. Forward two. We're going to try and move Poplar Wood Talon. He moves. Forward two. Um, then we're going to go two, three, four, five. And two, three, four, five. Uh, one, two, three, four, five. And one, two, three, four, five. And that'll be my turnover. Mm. Okay. So Kleist is going to move. Yep. Two plus. Oh, sorry. Two plus. Yes. Six. Going to hit not gaze Kindro. Yep. Yes. Hypnotic. Gonna move Sonia. Yep. Mm. Gonna try pro. Okay. No. No. Nah. Okay. And hypnotic poplar. Yep. Yep. He's on. And now you've got to knock down someone, don't you? Yeah, so we've knocked down Henrik. Yep. Uh, so, so he... injury roll, is that right? Yep. He's KO'd. Ah, oh, dear. Oh, well, right. never mind. Opens up the road for Adelhard, I guess. Yep. He's going to blitz Hamfast. Okay, I'm going to use Dump Off. First off, okay. so before you move, I did do my pass action. He's going to attempt to pass it to Deagle Gardner. Uh, so it'll be a short pass. So it'll be on a four plus. Um, okay, so it's going to be inaccurate. Uh, so the ball will end up going. 
Do we work out where the ball ends up going before, before we do before the you, intercept? Before you do the intercept, yeah. I believe so, because you go, obviously if you throw the ball backwards, I don't know then how the intercept would work. Y so. Yeah, okay, that's fine. Yeah. So it's... Uh, four. Oh, okay, so he throws off the pitch. So it's going to I come... can still attempt to intercept. Yeah, you can still attempt to intercept. So you roll the, roll the intercept now. So it's interfering at minus one because you're marked. I'm not marked. He's hit not ghost. I oh, know. That's right. Yeah. So, so, it's, so it's, and it's, it's an inaccurate pass as well. It, so it's not as bad. To yeah. Catch. I think it's only a minus. I think it's only a minus two. two minus two. Yeah. Minus so three four for plus. Yep. 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 Okay. And he's got to catch the ball on a two plus, I guess. Catches the ball. There you go. So that's an intercept. The first intercept of the entire league. Yep. So record. So I'm just going to record this so that everyone yep. can lose their minds. Yep. Um, so you got to go to no, not deflection. If you go oh, to, not, uh, okay. if you when you go to intercept, when you go to interference, it should give yep. you the choice of. Um, no, it just says interference. Um, let me see. Okay, well, um, put it put it in interference for now because I'm sure I'm sure there's a way to get the. Um, let me see if I can go and uh, do. Do it as the the coordinator. It was. <laughs> Seems a bit odd that you'd have to put it in like that. I mean. Yeah, I mean, the part of it might be that it's not that you you can't. It's hard to intercept on your turn, but like that's <laughs> like that's exactly how. Um, that's how it's worked out. Dump yeah. off, yeah. Okay. So. Um, all right, keep 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 playing through. I want to double check how to to do it. But, okay, uh, yeah. right. So, Adelhard, let's see if he's eat, gonna eat someone at the end of his blitz. Yep. No, he's gonna be fine. So I have to go for it to actually throw the blitz. Yep. Yep. Three dice. Got him. Got him. I'll fend. You fending? Yep. Okay. that through? Uh, no, it's not. He's a hefty. Yeah. Okay, we need to find out where the ball comes back in. Oh, yes. Before so, I carry on going. So it went off. Uh, so it will come back in. Actually, we, we should have done it before he moved as well because he could have moved through the space the ball was in. Oh, okay. So we'll go straight ahead. Uh, seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Oh, no, no, no. He intercepted. What are we doing? I'm doing it. So you're right. So, yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah sorry. sorry. Yeah. <laughs> Just disregard. I'm so used to not getting something like that happen. Okay. Yeah. Can I have to dodge to there? <sighs> yep. Just doing some one more thing with. Uh... Yeah, it looks like it doesn't. Looks like it only tracks deflection versus interception if you're running star player points. Oh, okay. Yeah. Otherwise, it doesn't give you the option. Fair enough. But we know. We know. Yeah. We know that the leader in interceptions is is Kleist Iquad. Yeah. And he will be forever. <laughs> okay. End of turn. Okay. Cool. Uh, so you're not sure. So start turn. All right. So I need to do the order this correctly because of the marks. So. And I, hypnotic gazes. Yeah. I think I need to start with, so I'm going to stand up ham fast and move him forward. I'm going to um, have Poplar block Adelhard. So it'll be 
a take root. Yep, be two dice. You do not have dodge. Okay. I will stay where I am. That's not through armor, he with mighty blow. Then I will have um uh hit kind root block kleist. Okay, so that'll be two dice. Six versus five, yeah. Got him. Got him. I will follow. I was gonna bounce straight into D Uh nine with mighty blow is with enough. mighty blow yep, is so regular just injury. enough. So he is badly oh, hurt. So I'm gonna got... use my apothecary. Well so it, apothecary happens before regeneration, doesn't it? So he goes into Do a casualty for kind of a branch. And the ball goes to four, which is onto <laughs> onto Deagle Gardner. Exactly yeah. who I said it was. Uh, right. Who will catch it on a four? Now does catch apply to a loose ball? No. No. It catch doesn't it. matter. All right. <laughs> Uh, well, I should probably have him start doing something then. So he's going to go one, two, three, four, five. Uh, go for it. Come on, one. You son of a bitch. Go for it. Right there. Okay. And then we'll go one, two, three. Actually, um, before I did that, uh, I'm going to go one. Two, three, water there. And then we're going to have auto blitz with stop. Okay. Uh, actually, no, sorry. Uh, I don't know. Uh, I'll just fuck it up. I haven't done Sega yet. Because Sega's the one that's got, got, um, got, uh, Dauntless. But I don't think okay. I, I, I can't get an assist onto that. So that'll just be a. So it's going to go one, two, three, uh, we're going to blitz. We'll make. I'll still blitz into auto. It's into okay. auto. Yep. So it'd be one dice. Push him. I won't follow up. And then Sago will block the stuff. Dauntless first off. Yep. So it'll be two dice. Just a push. And I won't follow. And that's my turn. Mm. Oof. Oof indeed. If the ball had gone anywhere but onto him, or he hadn't caught it, he would not be far enough away to... Yeah, not, yeah. he wouldn't be in this situation. So, what are we going to do? Because at the moment, he's looking at a 5 plus, 4 plus, 3 plus. Go what, for it. Go for it just to hold him up. Go right? for it just to hit him. But he has got strip ball. Okay. But those rolls to get there. Or I could do the one, two, three, four, five, six. Go for it. Go for it. Now we'll only mark. Yeah, the only person that can actually hit him is Gustav. And Sonia is going to move. Yep. Is good. Okay. Three plus dodge. With dodge. Dodge. <laughs> oh. Doesn't matter. Okay. All right. Uh, so armor. Uh, that is through injury. Yes, done. this is done. All right. Uh, my turn. As much as I my love... thought, what my thought was, if I could get around 
hypnotize Sago Heather Toes, at least then it's a four plus. Yeah. Only one four plus dodge, and that would have made it at least possible. As much as I'd love to throw some some potentially easy blocks, I'm just going to go in and score. So, good deal. That's fair enough. Yeah. So, let's uh, score for deal Gardner. All right, so uh, okay, we set all the players. Okay, you can have your player back. Uh, you can bring in down players. I'm kicking to you for one turn. Okay, I'm set up. Ooh, I'm set up. I'm trying to get the ball back here. Through to three is going to be bump, bump. And kick off event. There's a nine, which is a, uh, a quick snap. So D3 plus one of your players get to move one square. Four players move one square. All right, and the ball bounces to six, so to there. And you can start your final turn of the half. Okay. Okay. Or Treeman. What have they got? So one has pro. They both got pro. That's otherwise the default Treeman. So Mighty Blow, Stand Firm, Take Root, Throw Teammate, uh, Thick Skull, Timber. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Six. We're going to have Kleist do a pass. Yep. He's good. Two. Pick up the ball. Yep. Right. A pass to Sonia. Not using a set piece, I take it. No. <laughs> two plus. I'm not, not going to waste that. And then a two plus catch. There you go. There's a completion for Kleist. I'm going to have Adelhard blitz. Do I come in and blitz Poplar? That's the question. Or do I just go for the easy and smash the auto? It'd be two dice into Poplar. One dice. Yeah. That's not great, is it? You know what? We're going to take out Otto. Okay. So blitzing Otto. Yep. Good. Five. So it'd be three dice. No, he still needs to go for it. I think he's a he's a move what, five, is he? He's there only move five. Oh, okay. Oh. Um he falls over. Alright, no worries. That really sums up oh he gets through the armor. Through, through the armor as well. And he is KO'd. KO'd. Alright. Kind of sums up the half, doesn't <laughs> it? it? doesn't. I forgot to roll for KO oh, of oh, roll, roll, roll now to see if they wake up before that before that, that play. No, they didn't. No. Okay, okay, so all right, so let me, uh, first off, let's get everything reset back to normal. So uh, you've got a reroll back. I don't keep my reroll from I didn't use. Uh, reset every player. Okay, roll to see whether or not Adelhard wakes up. I'm on Adelhard. No. And we'll see if Henrik wakes up. Yes. Yes. Right. So. Um, I will be kicking to you, but before we do that, 
let's jump back to the locker room where in comes uh, Wilhelm. Lord Hugger, what a first half. That was a very odd game to play there. You you really uh, you took them apart in your, in your kickoff and got down there, scored easily. Yeah. And then just a, a bad bounce of the ball really put uh, the match back into contention for the halflings. It did. I mean, that, that interception by, by Kleist was a masterpiece. Um, perfectly done. And, you know, something we'll be talking about for a while there. Excellent. But then it just slip of the ball went the wrong way and there was nothing we could really do about it. It's unfortunate, but sometimes that's just the way the ball bounces. Yep. Now you're without your bar guys, but you do have, you are getting the ball and I have been watching uh, in the practice cages, uh, a bit of passing action going on between Kleist and uh, Sonia. So yeah, yep. the so tag team will, will go back out there again and hopefully we can make some magic happen and uh, get down there, score again. So, but not too quickly. <laughs> Confidence level high, would you say? Medium. Medium. Okay. Higher than it has been. I, oh. I feel more confident. We're not. We're not struggling to score to re-catch the match. Okay. Well, so hopefully we can do this. Just remember, the fans didn't come in to see scores. The fans came in to see dead halflings. So get right on that. Will do. All right. I am kicking to you. Uh, so. Need a nice, strong defensive lineup. Uh, do I swap out my? I think I saw my catcher. Pro. pro. You know this deep bench. <laughs> <laughs> you know who has deep benches? People who expect to get killed. Yes. All right. I'm ready to kick off. Okay. Okay. All right. I'm going to end the ball here. Four to four is one, two, three, four on trapdoor. Kick off event is two, which is uh, get the ref. So we both get a free buy inducement. Nice. And the ball bounces six, so to there. And. Uh, you can end turn, start turn on tour play. Okay. Throw a pass with Kleist. Yep. Oh, sorry. I have to roll to see if he's right. be hungry at the end of this. Uh, yep. We'll try pro. Yep. Okay. Roll again. And uh, roll again. No, he's not. Okay. Sorry. So pick up the ball. Two plus. Got the ball. Yep. And throw the pass to Sonia. Two plus. Yep, and two plus catch. Yep, another uh, completion for Kleist. No, I'm racking up player points for someone in the fantasy fantasy league, but really, <laughs> I, I don't care. <laughs> okay. That's you done. That's me done. Okay. So I will start my turn one. So I'm going to start by moving Kyrick Long Branch. Yes. And two. Uh, we are going to blitz Poplar Wood Talon into Otto Baumgarten. So take root. Yes. One, two. Go for it. Come on, fall over. And go for it for the blitz.
Okay, lock him there and pull up. Uh, no, with Mighty Blow. Okay, um, I have a sneaky get somewhere, don't I? Here's my sneaky get. It's my guy on the bench. Should I leave my sneaky get on the bench. Yeah, he left his sneaky uh, get on the bench. Unfortunate. All right. So, um, I guess other than that, I'm going to move uh, this guy up to here. Up here. I think I might just leave my rest of my players out as a safety right now. So, uh, I'm going to turn over there. Okay. Uh, move Sonia. Yep. Pro or? Uh, we'll pro. Yep, we'll roll the bloodlust. Yep, she's fine. So dodge. Two, two plus. It's good. One, two, three, six. So, I'm going to move Kleist. Yep. Going to try his pro. No. No, he's going to have to knock someone down at the end. Okay. So, we're going to go one, two, three, four, five, six. Go for it. Yep. <laughs> down he goes. All right. Uh, let's Straight run. through fucking hell. Ah, uh, it's just a stun. Alright. Uh, so I'll start my turn 8. Uh, so I'll start by going 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. I'm going to declare a blitz by Sega Heather Toes onto Sonya. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 for the blitz. 3 plus Dauntless. I will no. use a team reroll on that. Yes, that would be two dice. Um, you've got, you've got. Um, I've got block, block and dodge. So, just get pushed back. Um, I will not follow. We'll come in to here. Uh, then I will have um, Kinder at Long Branch hit Alba Schultz. Go for it. Not go for it, sorry, take root. Uh, I will throw. I will throw oh, the skull. Damn it. Come on. Oh, it's yeah. both down. All right. My, okay. armor, my armor on you. Not through. Your armor on me. Not through. Right, head over. <sighs> Damn it, this is too much thinking. <laughs> I can see you were two plus two plus away from scoring. I know, I know. I'm thinking of having a lineman do it. <laughs> but you had to declare at the start of the turn, I think, with uh, set piece. Start for, when I start to move. Is it, like at the start of the turn or the start of the activation? 
should be start the activation, isn't it? Let's double check. Um, set piece. Pull that guy no, back. we're inactivating a player. That's fine. Yes, it's out of activation. Yeah. Okay, so you can't blitz and throw, can you? No, not without razzle dazzle. Razzle dazzle, which you could have gotten if you roll better on your uh, help comes up last roll. That's three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, It's gonna kick kind root, kind root, okay. even with them, even with the minus okay, one. Okay, a twelve plus no worries. <laughs> no, no, but it's you can you, you can record the foul for uh, Otto Baumgarten. Yeah, I wonder whose fantasy fantasy team he's on. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Go for it. Yep. Fuck you. <laughs> You've got a reroll. I'm going to use my reroll. Okay. Fuck you. <laughs> Fuck you. Uh, Straight through. through. Yeah. Uh, he is KO'd. KO'd. Oh. Right. Your turn. Okay. Um, all right, so we're going to start with a block from Poplar Wood Talon into Otto Baumgarten. Come on, double skull. Take root. He's fine. It's a push from there. Um, all right, I will attempt to stand kind of long branch on a three plus. No, stay long on the ground. Um, all right. Yeah. One, two, three, four, five. And I'm going to blitz Sago into Sonya again. So dodge. three plus dodge. Come on, roll a one. With, yes. a, with a re roll. Into a one. And do a two is good, good enough. enough. Hey, armor roll. <laughs> uh, that's through. Injury. Come on, dead. Dead. No, it's done. Uh, KO because of our uh, uh, study. Okay. All right. Your turn for ten. I'm back. Albus is going to blitz ham fast. Yep. Got him. I'll fend. Oh, son of a bitch. I'm wrong. Not three. No. That's one. So that's one, two, three, four, five, six. Yep. Not going to go for it. <laughs> <laughs> I fucking had it. We're going for it. <laughs> I'm going to throw a set piece yep. with Sonia yep. to Albus. Okay. Do you, want to move, do you want to move anything first or just going to throw it straight from where it is? Just make sure, it, it just make sure it's within pass range, oh. uh, which it is. Yep. It's fine. Yep. It's fine. It's cool. So record a, 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 record a pass for Sonia. Nobody, nobody was in area to intercept. Okay. Gustav is going to hit. Oh, Ruby. Let, me just, let me just quickly check one thing. Sorry, I just want to check one thing. So I said it's pass. Pass ruler. Yeah, I just want to see if it passes over the base of uh, Ruby Ruby Galaxy. Um, pass from menu. Set as pass target. Uh, no, I'm going to say that that's missing the base, even though there's like there's like a little knock, but I don't I don't think that counts. So. That's fine. Uh, reset password. 
Here we go. Okay, so as you were. Okay. So Gustav is going to hit Ruby. Yep. Should be two dice. Two dice. Got him. Oh. Hammer. So he's going to move, dodge. Yep. Three plus. Down he goes. All right. Ah, uh, not through. All right. Ah, uh, yeah. So first off, stand up. Three, four, five, go for it. Okay. Uh, I'm declaring a throw teammate action with Poplar Wood Talon. Okay, it's going to go. So, first off, um, take root. It's fine. One. He is throwing Otto Dottingham. He's going to try and throw Otto to here. Yep. Uh, so, it would be a four plus because of strong arm. One. A one. Uh, yes. I'm going to use throw. No, he drops Otto at his feet. He drops Otto at four. Uh, Otto's got to land on a five plus. No, there he goes. The armor on Otto. Uh, that's true. Injury. He is stunty KO'd. KO'd. Excellent. Treeman spikes the half. <laughs> All right, back to you. Okay. Kleist is going to blitz. Yep. Yeah. Two plus. Nope. Pro. Pro. Yeah. Yep. And I'm going to reroll re -roll the blood loss now. Yeah. It's fine. It's going to hit Cedric. Yep. Five and it'll be three dice. <laughs> use the team reroll. Yeah, use the team reroll. <laughs> you, you don't have we planned this, do you? Nah. No. Okay. Nah. Right. Not yet. <laughs> Reroll the three dice. Let's push. Okay. Sonia is going to move. Yep. You're fine. Go for it. And the hypnotic gaze ham fast. Yep. Two plus. Yep, he's yep. hypnotic gaze. So you can just walk it in. Gustav is going to kick Ruby. Okay. That's your armor. That is a badly hurt and a send off. I will use my Bribe. Bribe. Yep. Okay. So record the foul and the casualty for Gustav. Does that still end my turn? It does end your turn, though, yes. Wow. Oh. Gustav. I need to record a 10 casualty. For Ruby. Gustav. And. All right. And. That's what we got in my turn. All right. Um, hmm. Hmm. Okay. But that counts as a stall as well. Oh, no. Is that uh, a dodge? 
No, uh, you have to have dodge it for you, so you're not stalling. Okay, so... Uh, I'm going to attempt to... It's going to make a difference because it'll still be three versus four, so two versus four. So do I, I, mean, I, I don't think I can get anything better than two dice down lock on Schultz. Um, other than trying to get a player over to the treatment and throw the player hoping to hit you on your players. I'm just, I'm just going to start with a two dice down block from Hamfast onto Schultz. So both down or only you down? We'll go with a both down. All right. Um, so, I'm going to roll on you. On. Not through. I'm rolling me. Not through. I really should have moved Poplar Wood Town. I was, gonna, I was considering like going for it twice to just try and mark Sonya. I should have. Yeah. All right, and the ball go to one is right beside him. And it's your turn five. You need a two plus with no re-roll. To not get a draw, Mike. But I'm greedy. Yeah. So Gustav is going <laughs> to blitz Cedric. Okay. All right. Uh. Okay, you got him. Got Injury. Oh, seriously hurt for Cedric as well. So that won't, that won't be a casualty for you because it was by the crowd. Ah, that's a shame. Yep. I need to pad my stats. 11 for Cedric. So. Okay. So. Albus is going to stand up. Now Sonia is going to move. Yep. Going to try pro. Yep. No. Okay. So okay. <laughs> pick up the ball. Yep. I would have said the pro pick up the ball, to be honest. Okay. You got the ball. <laughs> she goes in. Scores, and, then... and as part of her victory celebration... As part of her victory celebration, she... she... KO's house. <laughs> stuns him, stuns him. Oh, stuns him? Eight? Seven. Oh, oh, seven, sorry, seven. Oh, seven, right. Yeah, okay. Uh, but she scores. So record the touchdown for Sonia. Uh, it was a bit long-winded and complicated. Yep. But... All right. Uh, so, reset all players. I think you've got a turn. Though. I do. I do have a turn. Don't deny my turn. Uh, so uh, I'll roll to see if anyone wakes up. Does Sago wake up? Uh, he does not. Does Otto wake up? He does not. And what do you about for your plays? You've got a few in the in the. Uh, so Henrik, yep. does Henrik wake up? No. No. Does and... Adelhard wake up? Yes. yes. All right, you're set to kick off. There we go. All right. All right, making the ball too. All right, deviate. Come on. Two to three is right to your line. Only three is yeah, there. That's it. And then kick up event. Eight is changing weather. So uh, roll to six again. Uh, it's the same, so ball will get blown three times. So, D8. Come on, stay on. No, off it goes. Okay. All right, so I will start my turn. 12. 12. <laughs> All right, so the only two things I want to do. First off, I'm going to declare a pass by hand fast to deal with Gardner. So, one, two, three, four. It'll be a three plus pass. Come on. Roll better than a two for once in your life. Yes, it'll be a three plus catch with a reroll. Yes, okay, so I've got a pass for hand fast. He's going to run over and hand off to the guy in the middle. He's mm -hmm. going to get thrown down the pitch. 
land perfectly, run in, score, and prevent me from getting my win. I was actually just freaking, I was going to just like yeet that guy at your line and try and hit somebody, but yeah, it's a pretty good idea. So yeah, Teagle Gardner will declare a handoff. So one, two, three plus handoff. Yep, handoff successful. We will declare a pass by Poplar Wood Talon. Uh, he will aim for there. So that would be a five plus. So be, yeah, five plus pass. Uh, I'll, I'll take the three DV8s because that's going to be the case anyway. Three DV8s. Oh, I've got to figure out the pass out so I can see where I'm going. Pass chart one off. Goes backwards. Backward one. one. Okay. Good, good. Goes forward one. No, not good. Come on. Come on. Eight. Four. Okay. okay. It's going to land between two people. So he's already a three, four for inaccurate pass, five. So he needs a six to land properly. No. Down he goes. Uh, Armor roll. Uh, that's through. Injury. Come on. Dead. Uh, that's ah. badly hurt, though. <laughs> Another casualty for the... Not up for a play, but for your team, definitely. Yep. So that was a, a injury of 10. Well, who was that? I just knocked out. It was was uh, Clamity Jewfoot. And the ball, oh. for posterity's sake, goes to 6 right in front of Kleist, who ignores it as the final buzzer goes off. And you finally get... Your first win of the season. All right, so let me just reset all players. And I'll give you back your player. Bring our other players out who are still alive, which are nobody died. What a lovely no one died. Um a few casualties though. I've got to pull five halflings out of the uh, out of some form of injury. Whether it's uh... I didn't suffer a casualty. I think that's the first time in a game. Yeah, where I've not suffered a you, casualty. Your vampires need to lift their game. Uh, all right, so we can both go end of match in tour play. Yep. Right. I will quickly delete any quitting players, of which there are a few. Kinder does not quit. Otto does not quit. Sonia does not quit. All right. Uh, so I, you can roll for dedicated fans first. D six. Six. Yours go up. To play. I'll roll to see if mine goes down. Six. It does not. Where were these rolls a few minutes ago? Uh, all right. So put your dedicated fans in. Okay, cool. Now uh, let's do the. I'm going to do a training roll to try and improve my training options. That doesn't help. What about you? You going to do training? Yeah, I'll try training. Yep, with plus two means you can pick the second oh. pick of the the skill from the the table. Plus three, so. Yep, and do you do you have um anything I else? I do not have okay. anything else that affects it. So. Who do you want to give a skill to? We're going to go random player. Okay. Because I don't have, because I can't, don't have um, Lana here. All right. So I'm going to, we go left to right as we're looking at them, as I'm looking at them. So Henrik is one, uh, Adelhard is seven. Okay. Come on, seven. Three is Gustav. Gustav. So he's got strip ball at the moment. We're going to give him a strength skill. Okay. So strength skill. Do you want to? Well, so roll roll, roll a dice for what table it's on first, and then you get to pick from that table. One low okay. table. Okay. So your options are armbar, brawler, break tackle, grab, guard, juggernaut. Guard. Guard. Okay. So put round seventy five for now. We have to fix up in a moment. Um. I am also going to do a random secondary because I just love that with the halflings. So I've got one, two, three, four, five, six, Dave seven. Adelhard, eight, the random skill. That sucks. I want him to have the random skill. Right. Never mind. It's going to do 2d6 minus one. See which player. It, oh, actually, no, that, 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 that would that'd be a skewed variant. So I'll do a d16 until I get a um, three, four, five, six, eight, nine or under. 
Yep. Oh, like all I recommend. Stop rolling high the D16. It's ridiculous. Okay, nine. So uh, left to right, that is uh, Poplar Wood Talon. It's a secondary. Um, so Freeman secondaries. Uh, Do they get general or secondary? Hope so. Halfling teams. Freeman. Uh, yep, general. Julia, general or passing. Um, oh, do I give him a passing skill? A lot of passing skills do affect throw teammate, don't they? A lot don't, though. You know, some just, do. Some do, but he's got a five plus passing normally. I'm just going to give him a general skill. So, random skill, general. He gets frenzy. A frenzy <laughs> dreamer. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I see lots of go for it's in his future. <laughs> okay, so, random secondary. Um, all right, now, uh, I'm declining getting a sponsor because I can't possibly roll the number. Do you want to try and get an extra sponsor? Yeah, I'll try for an extra sponsor. All right, so what's the, what are the pluses that up to on your screen? Uh, without without the roll part. So dedicated fans, five, match three, touchdowns, two, injuries, favor, three. So that's so six, 13. seven, eight, uh, 13. 13. Yeah. So D6, roll the D16 plus 13. No, not enough. Okay. <sighs> Because you wasted all those higher yeah. rolls, yeah, I blame okay. you. So decline on two point. Okay, so we need to do for you a D three for your um for your uh, uh, sponsor. Ten thousand, which is what was rolled naturally, and then roll a D six to see when one of your players pisses off the sponsor. They did not. I have to roll two D three. I get twenty thousand and. 10,000, which is what tool play rolled, and 2d6 to see if I piss off a sponsor. I do not, and I do not. Okay. Uh, all right, let's see. So you can just go into your team now and hit the random skill player, hit the random skill, see what it comes up with, and we'll fix it after that. Yep. Uh, add all hard. He gave Adelhard dirty player. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so we need to get rid of strip ball from him. And this Poplar Wood Talon got frenzy as you do. How much XP do I get there? Uh, I'll, I'll, I'll take that quite a bit because I got the intercept. Yeah. Um, so that's half weeks done. And then you, so it went to Adelhard. Yep. I need to take off dirty player from Adelhard. And so I need to give it to was it Gustav, wasn't it? Gustav got oh, um, guard. guard. Tears strength. Guard. Cool. Alright. Uh so and then uh XP, loot and XP. So going to the Knights, you Played, you won, you scored twice, you got two casualties, uh, no, you got uh, three casualties, no kills, three passes, and an intercept is six XP. Excellent. All right, played, got one touchdown, no casualties, no kills, one pass, so I got three XP for the Raiders. So I didn't think, as soon as I scored, I thought, oh, Mike won't, Mike won't be able to get the um, extra skill this turn because he can't get six without getting a lockout, but he found the way was to get an intercept in there. Yeah, so, yeah. So Raiders. So that actually gets me. Yep. To my next playbook, which yep. is going to go to former player. Yep. Which gives me planning for the worst. There we go. Ooh. Nice. Okay, let me go back to uh, oh, my screen. Where's OBS gone? Here it is. Lord Hunger. Wow, what an end of that match. That was uh, and, and daring there, like holding up your player, giving your uh, the rest of your team long enough to uh, to throw a, a, a cheeky send off or push off. Yeah, yeah, we need we 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 heard you what you said. The fans are here to see us kill halflings, so we had to inflict some violence, even if it was just knockouts. 
We even gave the fans the opportunity to inflict their own violence on the halfling. I mean, what else can you do? And correct me if I'm wrong, this is your first time playing halflings, isn't it? Yes. Yeah. Yes. How did, how, was, how did you find the raiders? Um, they're actually a lot more tricky than I thought. That 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 uh, ham fist. They're they're, they're hefty. He's, he's he's a bit of a tricky player there with fend and uh, that slightly tougher armor. Yeah, yeah, a bit of a bit of a concern. But in the end, my players finally managed to show that, that they can get the job done. I'm still a bit disappointed with the way they were moving out there on the field, but hopefully, you know, after the beatings, they'll they'll continue to improve. Nice. And uh you of course you'll have Vina back next week as well. Yes, yeah. yes, which will be a, a welcome relief. So let's take a quick look at where that puts our standings today. Um if I go to screen here. And so that puts you up to sixth place right now. Um, although there are a few teams below you still to play, probably the Coaddles and the Hammerers. Whoever wins that match will push themselves in front of you, and then likely also the winner of the oh. uh, Kodiaks and Warrior Priests. I, I'm hopeful that we're, we're going to see some more draws, and uh, I'm, I'm going to be able to maintain a decent, decent pace there. Yeah. Uh, and for the Raiders, that puts the Raiders in 12th place, uh, still ahead of the Butchers, Marauders, Race, and Fanatics, though the Fanatics and Marauders still need to play this week as well. So probably not looking that great for the Raiders with uh, with only four games to go, uh, but anything is still possible at this point in the Brew Bowl. Anyone could still get to the top, depending on how other teams do. So don't count it's... any team so at this point in time. Exactly, exactly. Yeah. All right, Lord Hunger. Any other comments you wanted to make? Bob, oh, how did the brain do? How did how did Watson's brain do? Um, he was okay. He's acceptable. Uh, I think we'll give him another trial run. Um, probably won't hire him onto the team for good though. Not yet. Not yet. Very well. Oh, actually, you know what we said? We didn't check. We didn't. I didn't look to see whether anyone needed to spend some money. Or the half needed to spend some money. Otherwise, they're going to be doing expensive mistakes. I definitely have to spend some money. Okay. okay. No worries. Well. We'll uh, do that in a sec. Okay, no worries. <laughs> All right. Well, to the audience at home, thank you for watching us once again on Cabal Vision. More games to play. We are um, we're halfway through round four, uh, almost the end of the middle of the season. Uh, and, of course, don't forget, for those who follow our Fantasy Fantasy Football League, uh, there will be a redraft in the middle of the season as well. So stay tuned for that. Plenty more to come on Cabal Vision. Don't touch that dial. And to you, Mike, excellent game. Finally got there. Yeah, we both had some terrible rolling at some parts and some great rolling at some parts. Yeah. So <laughs> still far too many ones into ones for yeah, my life. It, it wouldn't but... it wouldn't be you if you didn't get a one into a one at some point during the game. Yeah. Yeah. Um what do I do with my half league's money? Um they got too much right. We now. have to do the draft as well. Yeah, I am gonna oh that's right. Okay, well let me put I'm gonna I'm the half gonna put some money into the stadium fund. Yep. So that, that will get them out of out of the financial trouble. Uh, so let me see. The halflings need to do a management role, and their management is at a plus one, plus one. Yeah. So I'll just go back to tool play, oh, two play, two to TTS. Uh, okay, plus one is a six, so that's no good. They'd be doing a full regular draft. So players of theirs who got skills this, um, uh, this season, let me see. So, Pantry Raiders. Okay, so Cedric had uh, priority, and he's fine. Otto had picked up Diving Catch, so Otto will go on a one. Uh, Otto is fine. Uh, Sago had Dauntless already. Ruby picked up pro, so Ruby will go on a one. No, he's fine. He's fine. Uh, Deagle uh, picked up Sneaky Git this season. It's fine. And I d we don't roll for Poplar, who got the skill this, this game, because it was from um, uh, this game, and you would have rolled draft first. Okay. All right, so for you, management roll. No one can be affected by the draft. The only person who could is Gustav, yep. and he got it this game. Okay, no worries. Cool. So everyone it. else either got their skills from being hired yep. 
or from last season. Yeah, or, or as a pro, your protege in the case of or Lyman. As a protege. Yeah. Okay, yeah. cool. All right. All right. Oh, there you go. Draft is done. Sorry, Mike. Yeah. Um, no, no, that's okay. So yep. cash wise, yep. I have 265,000. Yes. I might buy a second stadium because why not? Well, let you put money in the saving fund when you own a stadium? I don't mm. even know. No. How much is a stadium? Uh, 250,000. Yeah, I've got 265. I could just buy a stadium. Yeah, but I don't, I don't think it will let you own two stadiums, though. Oh, damn it. Right. Okay, in that case, I think it's time to blow some money. Got the full complement of vampires. I am going to hire. Oh, actually, hold on a sec. I was looking at the wrong screen. Maybe, maybe you can. One sec. I'll go to stadium. Yeah, I, I can add more to the fund, but you can't buy a second stadium. It looks like. Disappointing. Yeah. Okay. Um. Let's buy two thralls. So I'm going to hire two new thralls. Yep. Can one... I roll the management for both or just for one of them? Uh, you can roll it for... Let me double check what the rules say for that. That's an excellent question. This is a new rule. Um, whenever a new player is hired, so you can roll it for each person. So I'm going to hire two new thralls and I'll roll for both of them. Yep. Management's at plus three, so... First one, no. He's... No new skill. Second one. Uh, yes. Okay. Yes. Yeah. So they're they're general, aren't they? Aren't they? Yeah, general. So random general. His random general is dauntless. Dauntless. Not bad. It's not terrible. Yeah. Okay. I'll come up with names for those guys. All right. So I'll add dauntless to. I haven't, I haven't actually added the two players yet. Let me just add them here. You'll still need to roll one. D6 for expensive mistakes because you still be above 100,000. That's okay if the players blow some money. Um, so Edmund. I'm going to change that to Edmund. I'll rename the other guy, but Edmund, give him Dauntless. Dauntless. And for expensive mistakes. Yes. Of course. D3. So D3. Roll a D3, yep. Yeah. Three. They spend 30,000 of your money. Yeah, they okay. celebrate I'll with new off. uniforms. All right. More puffy vampire shirts. Okay, do they do they get a do they get a uniform for the for the brain in the jar? Like just like a little thing you can tie around the uh oh, No they, no they no, they, they get they get him a little hat and yeah. a little li little like band that they tie around it with a necktie attached. Okay, no worries. And a whistle that you can't use. <laughs> <laughs> That's right. Next we'll get we'll get him a sports jacket that just sort of hangs <laughs> on, on the edge of the edge of the jar. All right, and he's, he's not he's not being hired to it anyway yet. All right, well that's it, Mike. Thank you for playing once again. Uh, and and at short notice, I might add, this would have been my my regular Pendragon game uh, with AP, but uh, that that had to be re retimed. So Mike, at short notice, put aside his his Sunday to uh, to play Blood Bowl with me and to entertain you. So send 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 your love Mike's way, sorry Lord Hunger's way. All right, we'll be back soon with some more games this week. I've got, uh, I think, two or three more games this week and then one more game next week um, to get it all done. Uh, so then we'll be on to round five. So uh, thanks for watching. Stay tuned to YouTube. Plenty more to come. We'll see you next time.